knows some tricks for a rookie. Oh. What is keeping Leo up? He is getting tattooed here, and he has to go, and it's over. That's what the boss is about. Got to like the power, got to like the accuracy, got to like the spite as well. A little bit of edge about him in there, would you, you need that. Yep, and the fact that he was never in any hurry. He knew, if I don't get him out this time, I'll get him out next time. Left hand to the body. Oh, nailed him, that right hand. And then the injuries he got back up, uh, you know, I thought it was over at that point. I mean, look at, the, look at the way he's crumbled to the floor here. One more punch will get him out of there, and I think Howard Foster's getting ready to step in here because nobody wants to see Butlin get hurt. Body shots coming in, he's all over the place here, and that's it, the towel comes in. Howard Foster says that's enough. And yep, he's in no hurry. Oh, that might be the end of that. A really sharp. Just lunges in. You've got to credit his bravery, but he's getting a pounding in there, and that's that. No, it's been stopped. All over. Yeah, the way he worked the body was impressive, too. The balance that he has, and the way he can get punches, put punches together. Excellent performance again from Joshua. And we'll be seeing him again in just over a week, I'm sure. Well, all he can do is stop what they put in front of him. Struggling. He's in trouble. And there is an argument that's to say enough. that's enough, and it is. The starch wasn't going to go easy, but he was hurting, and he was hurting badly. Just the right time to get him out of there. And it was pretty obvious. Now, that was it. You could see him all over the place. I mean, it wasn't just that punch. He looked at his corner there as if to say, what have you done to me? And he's gone. And I don't think he wants any part of this. He's holding his ear as if the ear's gone, but now, no. He's moved it away and he's not getting up. He had no interest. So I wonder maybe if there's some damage been done there, but that was a decent punch. Getting the high guard up there as Joshua died. Oh, that right hand up the you're in desperate trouble, and he's done. One big right hand. Uh, looking to kind of just bold, it, bold, bold his way in and throw power shots. It's, a, it's that first uppercut again. And uh, again, it was something that Joshua knew was there, but he didn't overexert himself to find it. He waited to set it up, and there it was the end again. Joshua looked to land the right hand, but he's taking his time and measuring it up, and that right hand did the damage. He just waited. Inside two rounds for Joshua, takes his time, measures him up again, skulls all over the place. Steve Gray says that's it. Smile from the Watford man. Oh, oh yeah. that's the one. Didn't miss that time. Took everything, didn't he? One big right hand and a punch. That was bang on the chin. He did well to take that. He's still be in there. Full credit to him. And it gets another one. The towel's coming, and he got absolutely. Slaughtered with a left hand right on the uh, right on the decision of Steve Gray to jump in. Trying to tag him back. But again, just too sharp and too powerful from Joshua, who's slicing him to ribbons here. And Ian John Lewis might have a job to do because backed off is so brave, he's standing up to this, but he is getting pounded, and Ian John Lewis did absolutely the right thing. Well, I thought he was stopping it. He should and he will, it. and he has. Past his best now, right now comes through and he's wobbled, he's shaken by that and Joshua straight on him and Sprott's in big trouble here. Joshua just teeing off Is that and Tiro Connor says that will do it right there. Have been sick. Stunning. There's no need for Michael Sprott to take. Bang, that's the one, that's the job finished. Job's finished. And down he goes again, left hand again. Two, and Victor Lachlan's got to put an end to this. Four, because five, Gavin is a brave, brave six, man, but I don't think, yeah, he's going to give it a go again. Eight, but this is this is getting ugly here, and it's waved off. It's done. I saw that in his last fight, I think, Jim, that, that, and you know, he was asked about it afterwards, and he more or less just swatted it away with, with a shrug. But that's gonna, if, 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 if he develops that habit. Shannon brings a shell of the fighter he once was, and a right hand lays him out, beautifully timed by Anthony Joshua, and the count's at eight, this is done and dusted, it is his sixth second round win.
And his 12th straight victory in all. AJ. One single shot. Boom. Joshua going to work. Once again, and nails him. Now he's got rid of it, but can Johnson survive? Joshua looking to just blitz him out of there. Inside a round, there goes the bell, and Johnson is finished. The punches he's taken there. Well, that reputation for durability is well, well deserved, but how much longer can this go on? And it's stopped, it's over, done, inside two rounds. Kingpin just got bowled over. It was vicious and it was calculated. I mean, you just wonder who do we suggest? Tony Thompson, uh, Price. You know, but the, he, he wants there? an opponent with who he'll get credit. Yep, I mean, we don't want to see him overstretched. But uh, we certainly do want to see him in a, a match that is least competitive. And uh, we haven't seen that yet. He's far too good for the level he's been performing at. And look at the smile on his face there. Now 13 and 0, 13 KOs, and he is still WBC International Heavyweight Champion, the AJ from the UK, Anthony.